Good morning, NCS Eagles. These are your morning announcements for Friday, February 28th. Hi, I'm Jacob Pettit. We will be having a spirit night at PDK on Thursday, March 5th. 20% of the proceeds will come back to NCS. Attention all 6th to 12th grade students. You should have received an email to your student account from Mr. Atkins that has a link to a yearbook survey. Please fill that out as soon as possible. This is crucial for creating the yearbook. The more people that respond, the better and more memorable the yearbook will be. What's up Eagles, I'm Jack Stubblefield. The annual spring book fair is back. Just go to the lower school library between now and March 6th. Look on library doors for hours. If you like to read, make sure to go check it out. What's up Eagles, I'm Jake Fijan. Women always have your key card on you. If anything happens to it, please go to the front office immediately. Hi, I'm John Owen Delavante. The Lost and Found is overflowing with items. If you think you lost something, please check the Lost and Found because unacclaimed items will be donated. Hi, I'm Winston Zouyu. The deadline to register for the high school spring retreat is today. Pick up a form in the front office or register using the link in the weekly email. The cost is $60 and scholarships are available if needed. It looks like it is just about time for the spring sports to begin because on Tuesday, high school softball has a home scrimmage against Hume Fogg at 4.30 p.m. and high school boys soccer has a scrimmage against McEwen at 5 here. Today at 6 o'clock, we will be having our dodgeball tournament. Team sign-up sheets are available on Miss Love's door. Teams may have up to eight players total. The cost for each player is $5. <laughs> sign-up <sh> sign up <laughs> stop! Sign up <laughs> sheets and all money are due to Miss Lowe by 315 today to play. Any <laughs> anyone can come watch and pay two dollars at the door, cash only. And this enters you in a raffle. Spectators may play in the halftime basketball knockout game for a prize. There will be pizza and drinks available for purchases as well. <laughs> Bring cash to purchase. The event will be at six o'clock in the high school gym. Hope to see you guys all there. <laughs> What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? Last year, I was playing tag and I slammed my knee into a pole and now I have tendonitis. So. Ouch. Thank you. Still. What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? The greatest physical pain I ever endured was back up in my old house and we had concrete stairs to the basement and I was walking down them with a laundry basket and I slipped and fell down the concrete stairs and I bruised my tailbone really badly. I could not do sit-ups. Wow, that must have hurt. Oh yeah, it hurt really bad. Okay, thank you. Thank you. What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? Um, the greatest physical pain that I ever endured was I had a perforated eardrum on my left ear and I thought it was swimmer's ear, so I put swimmer's ear drops in and it burned. <laughs> You're not supposed to do that. You're not supposed to use like alcoholic drops in your ear or else that will happen. Ouch. That must have hurt. It did hurt. <laughs> okay. Thank you. What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? Uh, in kindergarten, I broke my arm by jumping a hurdle because I wasn't tall enough to make it over and my arm bent around it and it sucked. Ouch. That must have hurt. Thank you. What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? Uh, one time when I was in kindergarten, I had this giant bunk bed and I was sleeping on the top. And one time when it was uh, when I was supposed to get uh, ready for school, I fell out and it was like face first and I busted my chin, I split it open and I had to get nine stitches. Wow, that must have hurt. It was pretty bad. Okay, thank you. What's the greatest physical pain you've ever endured? I've been fortunate that I have not had a whole lot of pain, but the worst was, oddly and strangely enough, an incredible hamstring cramp when I was in my office at home. I started screaming like a third grade cheerleader who lost her pom-poms. My wife rushed into the office. When she saw what it was, she laughed and turned away. Oof, that must have been hurt. Wait. That's why you asked what's the phys greatest physical. That was it. <laughs> okay, thank you. The Bible verse of the day is Matthew 21, 21. Jesus replied, Truly I tell you, if you have faith and do not doubt, not only can you do what was done to the fig tree, but also you can say to the mountain, Go throw yourself into the sea, and it will be done. Please bow for the prayer. 
Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this day. Thank you for all that you've given us. Thank you for giving us the ability to come to school and learn about you. Get a good education at the same time, Father. Thank you for all the students, faculty, and staff. In Jesus' name, amen. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Craig Hughesby has challenged the high school soccer boys team to a five mile run at 3.30 around the Nashville Christian School campus. For every player that beats him, he will donate $100 to the program. So come out and watch day at 3.30. This is your Friday morning announcements. Everyone have a great day and have a great weekend. Boom.